This is a team that's starting to get back to full health, and you needed to win probably both these games, and, and you did. What can you say about the, the effort from your club this weekend? Uh, I think we we put a, gr a great effort uh, out there this weekend, you know, with uh, g great leaders coming back uh, into the lineup. It helped us uh, a lot, and I think uh, we uh, we worked really hard this weekend. We played as a, as a team, and uh, it showed out there. Are you lobbying now to coach about getting more shorthanded time based on the amount of both your shorthanded goal and the other shorthanded breakaway chance you got? Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm, we're, we're playing well, me and uh, Girard together. Uh, we, we've uh, been together for a couple games now. I think we start to get a certain chemistry, and uh, I think we just have to keep it simple and uh, communicate out there, and uh, it's going to help us to be like even better. Got a bit of a French connection with uh, Emil Poirier, and now with Girard. Did you, do you like he just he didn't even did you call for that pass, or did he know you were going to be there? Oh, I called for that pass. I I was all by myself, so I, I yelled so hard, and he just listened to me. And because usually he's, he always shoots, that's what he says. So, yeah, I yelled, and he gave it to me. And uh, yeah, that was a great pass. When you're having success like this as a team, a lot of times you look towards the goaltender. What can you say about the play of Eric Comer? Oh, he's been awesome for us this weekend. I mean, he shut the door and he he, he made like key saves. Uh, even at the end, uh, in the third period, he made a great saves for us, and uh, he kept us in the game uh, the, for the two games this weekend. One thing you guys have done is relied upon one line specifically. I mean, and again, today we saw contributions from all across the board. What does that mean for this team? Uh, well, I think it, it's it's good for the coach. You know, you know that he can whatever the li whatever lines he put out there. Uh, he knows that we're gonna make the job, and then we're gonna either like create chances offensively or like uh, defend well in our zone. So I mean, and it's it's good for us, and it's like bad for the opponents because we can like we can play our four lines and we create stuff. So, yeah. What can you say about playing in front of this crowd for the last two games, almost full building for both games? Well, it gives us a lot of energy. Even today, uh, you know, we saw there was a, they did the wave once, and uh, you know, it's uh, no, it was great out there, and uh, they give a lot, they give us a lot of energy uh, for sure. Are you a fan of the wave? If I'm a fan, yeah. well, uh, I've never been part of one. That's yeah. that's one thing. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> is, there, is there a lot you can take from these two games into the road trip? Obviously, coming up right away in Texas. Uh, yeah, I think, uh, you know, just uh, creating traffic, putting a lot of pucks on that and being first on the rebounds. Uh, uh, and that's how we create a lot of offense out there. And I feel like when we get back in our zone, also uh, really like low and we support each other, uh, that's how we create more offensively.